Even though I'm a reporter, I'm telling you what's happening day to day at the White House, I'm still part of that we the people who are still forming a more perfect union. Our founding fathers who were white and I'm sure had slaves, and I'm the descendant of slaves. I am the descendant of a slave, Joseph Dollar Brown, sold on the auction block in Fayetteville, North Carolina. But at the end of the day, those founding fathers, they never realized that there would be an April Ryan questioning Bill Clinton, George W. Bush, the first black president, Barack Hussein Obama, and they never imagined that Donald Trump would be there either. But I stand on those pillars that our founding fathers put in place. My story is your story. You'll see yourself in it. But it's a story for all of us to not just say, wow, but it's a story that our children need to know, that this is what happened. I stand on the shoulders of Harry McAlpin, Alice Dunnigan, and Ethel Payne, those trailblazers, those black trailblazers at the White House, Gwen Eiffel, and so many others. But what happened to them in the 50s and 60s, 70 years ago, is happening today. So I encourage you to read, read my story. Everybody's got a story.